Welcome to Christiana Flourishing where we motivate you with God word. Courageous, be not afraid nor dismayed for the king of Assyria, nor for all the multitude that is with him, for there be more with us than with him. Say that with me, there be more with us than with him. With him is an arm of flesh. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They have an arm of flesh, but with us is the Lord our God to help us and to fight our battles. Hallelujah. And I'll tell you what happened. Then God said to Hezekiah, Be not afraid. Now that Sennacherib has boasted, said he shall not step foot into this city. Say with me that Antichrist spirit shall not take over my city. That Antichrist spirit shall not take over my country. Let me tell you one of the things they're doing. The buying up lands and forcing nations to give up ownership of their own lands. Do you know that? They're forcing nations to give up their sovereignty. And most of their people don't know it. They don't know it. The leaders of their government are signing away their, their country. Selling their country. I mean literally selling their country. Giving it up for nothing. They're getting nothing. What is promised to them is not given to them. It's not given to the country. It's given to companies from the nations that are forcing them to sign the agreements. They are literally selling their country. So one day, you get a letter for generations. They say, sorry, it is now owned by the government of China. Oh, is owned now by the government of the EU. You say what? Or oh, is now owned by the name a company. In some cases, they use a company from where you don't even know. They tell you all these lands all over, all that estate. Or all that village, you thought it was your grandfather's village. The village has been taken over. And where are you supposed to? You say, so where are we going? Ah, find out what has happened to homeless people in America. Throughout Europe, you have homeless people throughout Europe and America. Nobody cares. They only are using them for elections. In fact, they have a bill that they're trying to pass in one of the states to give homeless people, they call it people who are experiencing, quote, experiencing homelessness. That it is now called an experience. Not that they are homeless. They say to call them homeless is insultive. So it's not politically correct. So they change it to people experiencing homelessness. So they now, this proposal is to give them a right set up camp anywhere any public place they have a right they can stay in front of your house and you can do nothing about it do you know what they're trying to do they're trying to make those people comfortable in homelessness they don't care it's a human right to be homeless instead of saying 
let us build homes and quarters for them. No. They said, give them the right to be homeless. Catch you sleeping again, you'll be sorry. That's your last sleep for today. Until you go home to sleep. Not entering your country. You say in the name of Jesus. As Sennacherib was forbidden from entering into Judah and Jerusalem. So also thou and the Christ spirit will not advance into my city. You will not advance into my country. I repel your works in the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and pray. Thank you for watching. Please continue to use this word to pray concerning your nation. God bless you.